Fatma was a lovely, cheerful woman. Her house was always neat and clean. Her children were always seen happy and playing. Yusuf, Fatma's husband, went to work every day wearing a freshly ironed and starched shalvar kameez. But slowly, Fatma began to change. She felt overburdened by her household concerns and stopped calling her friends over for tea. She didn't feel like meeting anyone anymore. After a while, Fatma began to drift away from her daily routine and the atmosphere at home began to get tense. She started yelling at her children all the time and fighting with her husband. Small worries and concerns constantly started pressing on Fatma's mind. At night, she felt like her body was asleep, but her mind was wide awake. She always felt tired and frequently had body pain and headaches. She also didn't feel like eating much anymore. Fatma's previously neat and clean home was now messy and dirty. Fatma stopped taking care of herself and didn't feel like doing anything anymore. She started to think, I just need life to pass. Yusuf tried really hard to help Fatma feel better. With difficulty, he saved up money and took her to a well-known doctor. But it didn't make a difference. Fatma just got more irritated and started saying, I am not mental. One day, Aisha, Fatma's friend, stopped by and explained, Fatma's changing behaviors are symptoms of mental illnesses. These mental illnesses are called depression and anxiety. You might know depression as tension or mental pressure and anxiety as restlessness or uneasiness. Depression and anxiety can happen to anyone and are treatable illnesses. Just like people can recover from a cold and flu, you can also recover from depression and anxiety. But without the right treatment, depression and anxiety can continue to get worse. Counseling is one type of treatment for mental illnesses. Counseling is a treatment that involves no medication, but through conversation finds solutions to your worries and brings back mental peace and freshness back into your life. After a few sessions, she started going back to her routine life, gained self-esteem, confidence, independence, and happiness, and her children and husband were happy and cheerful again. For more information regarding depression and anxiety counseling, please contact your health worker or call 0335-283-9588 hotline number.